So let's talk about distributed systems ALE. What does ALE stands for? Application Link Enabling. So what is the benefit of ALE? So let's imagine three SAP systems running individually. Okay, so there's there's separate SAP installation production system one, two, and three. Now sometimes a uh, client may decide to go for different installations or for whatever technical reasons uh, that w that happened. Now the need is whenever transaction takes place in system 2 and 3 it should automatically show up in system 1 so system 1 should be in sync with system 2 and 3 in terms of the transactions so you can use the distributed systems ALE technology to achieve that so for example this green transaction is taking place in system 2 be with the help of ALE it's going to automatically flow into system 1 as if somebody entered this transaction into system 1 now this blue transaction took place in system 3 it automatically flew uh, flow uh, flew over to system one using this ALE technology as if somebody entered this transaction in system one so ALE could be used to keep one system in sync with the other okay so that's the whole concept of ALE so what we have done in this tutorial is we have gone through various terms and try to understand them conceptually so we will be looking at the demonstrations uh, of the real SAP system down the line and you will be uh, seeing all these terms in action but for now uh, it's important that you understand these terms conceptually okay now I'm gonna see you in my next tutorial